friends let us now go to our next question from je advance 2017 paper 1 physics and the questions from je advance 2018 have already been done and the links to which are given in the i icon our next question is a human body has a surface area of approximately 1 meter square the normal body temperature is 10k above the surrounding room temperature of t0 take the room temperature to be 300 kelvins for t0 equals 300k and the value of sigma into t0 raised to power 4 is 460 watts per meter square where sigma is the stefan's boltzmann constant which of the following options is or are correct option 1 the amount of the energy radiated by the body in 1 second is close to 60 joules option b if the surrounding temperature reduces by a small amount delta t0 which is less less than t0 then to maintain the same body temperature human being need to radiate delta w equals 4 sigma t0 raised to power 3 into delta t0 more energy per unit time option c reducing the exposed surface area of the body example by curling up the body allows the humans to maintain the same body temperature by reducing the energy loss by radiations and option d if the body temperature rises significantly then the peak in the spectrum of electromagnetic radiations emitted by the body would shift to the longer wavelengths friends this is a vague question from thermal properties of matter and may have one or more choices correct before going further please press the subscribe button and don't forget to press the bell icon to receive the notification of all my future videos let us now solve this question we know that a body of surface area capital a and at a temperature of capital t radiates heat which is given by heat radiated per second p radiated equal sigma into a into t raised to power 4 where sigma is the stefan's boltzmann constant however when the body is placed in an atmosphere at a temperature t0 then it absorbs heat which is given by heat absorbed per second comma p absorbed equal sigma into a into t0 raised to power 4 and hence the net heat radiated by the body is p net equals p radiated minus p absorbed or p net equals sigma into a bracket starts t raised to power 4 minus t0 raised to power 4 or p net equals sigma into a into t0 raised to power 4 square bracket starts round bracket starts 1 plus delta t divided by t0 raised to power 4 minus 1 bracket closed or opening by binomial expansion we get p net equals sigma a into t0 raised to power 4 bracket starts 4 into delta t divided by t0 that is equation One, substituting the values, we get p net equals 460 multiplied by 4 multiplied by 10 divided by 300, or 460 divided by 7.5, which on simplification gives me p net equals 61.33 joules. Hence, option A is correct. As we can see. In equation one, if the atmospheric temperature is decreased by 
a small value delta t0 then the extra amount of heat to be radiated by the body is given by delta w equals 4 sigma into t0 raised to power 3 into delta t0 therefore choice b is also correct as can be seen from equation 1 that the amount of heat radiated is directly proportional to surface area of the body so decreasing the surface area of the body decreases the amount of heat radiated by the body therefore option c is also correct we know that in black body radiations as the temperature of the body is increased then the wavelength that corresponds to the maximum intensity of the radiation shifts towards lower temperature and obeys the Wien's displacement law that is lambda max into temperature t equals constant the higher the temperature the lower the value of lambda max and hence option d is not correct to summarize options a b and c are correct whereas option d is not correct please note from the question it is not clear whether the examiner is asking for the absolute heat radiated by the body or the net heat radiated by the body. However, in the present question, we have solved it by assuming that he expects us to find out the net heat radiated by the body. Hence, this question is a vague question. I hope you could understand the question. Else, Write to me in the comment box and I will answer all your questions. Don't forget to comment, like and share this video with your friends and do visit us again for our next video. Till then, Jai Hind.